Today we are going to discuss about how to delete a database in MS SQL. In the previous part we have seen how to create a database and how to rename a database. In this part we consider how to delete a database. There are mainly two ways that we can do the delete operation. That is through Management Studio and through Code. First of all, considering how to delete a database using Management Studio. Let's open the Management Studio. Yes, you can see, I'm going to delete the database third database. For that, right click on the third database icon and select Delete. This will open a new window. As you can see, before clicking OK button, you need to check close existing connections. After that, click OK. This will delete the database. As you can see, the third database is deleted. Now, let's consider how to delete a database using code. For that, open a new query window, as you can see, and execute the delete operation command, drop database current database name. Here, the current database name is, I'm going to delete my database first database. By executing this code, as you can see, yes, we are able to execute this code successfully. That means the first database is deleted. Let's see. Yeah, as you can see, after refreshing the database icon, the first database is deleted. Before doing the delete or rename operation, we need to consider that whether our database is used by any other process or it should be rolled back. For that, we need to execute one command. Alter database database name, set it as single user with rollback immediate. That means we need to put the database in single user mode before deleting or renaming. And if any transaction is happening, we need to roll back them immediately. After executing this code, we can continue with the delete or rename operation. By this way, we can delete a database in MS SQL. Thank you guys for watching this video. Please visit technomark.in for more information.